Quite frankly, most people in corporate America are tired. They're overworked and abused and trying to survive in a hostile environment. They realize corporate America doesn't provide the satisfaction they really want in life. Unfortunately, they spend most of their waking hours there. They have not yet grasped the possibility that work could be totally different. Let's take a closer look at the problem. Do any of these symptoms sound like your workplace? Strong blame orientation and self-promotion? Abusive language on the work site? Feeling unheard and simply used as a tool? Micromanagement or an authoritative style of leadership? Withholding information from other departments? How about excessive rumors and backbiting? Or training and development used as simply an expense more than an investment? If this describes your workplace, I've got some good news for you. Based on my book, The Art of Servant Leadership, Designing Your Organization for the Sake of Others, we have been implementing a training system at a test site that has radically changed the corporate culture and radically changed the bottom line. When this company was bought in 2004, the annual revenue was $10 million. This year, they're expecting their annual revenue to be $200 million. The increase, according to all the corporate leaders, is directly related to changing the corporate culture. I started at the company 11 years ago, and when I started, the culture was very traditional and quite stale. I was really looking forward to an opportunity of applying my skills and experience, and after a few days, I realized that that wasn't going to happen, and so I was very disappointed. When we started practicing servant leadership principles within the organization, I saw a light at the end of the tunnel and was quite hopeful. In fact, I was able to really challenge myself, both personally and professionally, and see what I could do to help contribute to the mission and purpose of this company. You know, I'm so excited to be working with Tony Barron at the Servant Leadership Institute, being able to draw upon his experience having served 75 out of the top Fortune 100 companies has allowed us to learn more of what servant leadership principles actually look like in the corporate world today. I'm excited about that because servant-led companies actually produce 38% more profit than other companies. You see, we function best when we have a mission and purpose in life. My mission is to help profit, nonprofits, public and private organizations not settle for so little, but to want more than just financial quarterly earnings. We can have companies that are sustainable, profitable, and making a profound difference in this world.